Dude, I could have fucking told you that. I could have told you they weren't good Samaritans. Farm. I have Shock. never. Oh. I'm gonna run on home. My mom was gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Yep, Chet's gonna die. Probably by the hand of his parents, but whatever. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Reckon down the way things his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You brought a couple guests. Yes, he did. We, uh, need a place to stay. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. So, it's just you and your daughter then? <laughs> oh, not his daughter. He's a good Samaritan. Mm. Honey. Do you know this man? Yes. <laughs> okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Ah, oh, my legs are getting really uncomfortable. I haven't been sitting here for that long. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Hey, Herschel. How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed? before the car accident. <laughs> I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with, the girl? I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. <laughs> House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Clem Clem. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. Um, looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't <laughs> think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. A dead cop crawling I saw under. a cop come back from the dead. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks, Jeez, Herschel. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll Kill you. probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> we'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. <laughs> okay, that'd be perfect. Oh my god, look at Clementine's face. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come oh tomorrow, god. which way you think you're headed. Towards making, I suppose. Oh, the look on Clemmy's face. Freaking hilarious. It smells like... Poop. Manure. Manure? Like when a horse 
Plops. Just Plops. like that. <laughs> Plops. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. Hmm. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's a zombie apocalypse, girl. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Run away. I love you, baby. <laughs> what was that? What the hell was that? Just happened there. Hey, get up. Hey, Kenny. I mean, whoops. <laughs> what? Itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not a dad. Babe, sleep. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. Chicken. Wait, no. Fuck, what's his name? We better get going. <laughs> we won't hear the end of it. His name is not Chicken. Is it Swan? That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Okay. <laughs> like, parents name their kid Duck? Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable trait lately. Huh. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. <laughs> <laughs> but he makes up for it with enthusiasm. He's dumb as a bag of hammers. <laughs> Word is, you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. <laughs> Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. Clemmy. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. Yeah. On the tractor? Cool! <laughs> That's the I will hop to. He used to sit on I the tractor. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. I'm not afraid to beat a head in. Fucking whoop some ass. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Alright, I know I shouldn't be doing this. And my mouse is in the way. I know that too, but. Ah, oh, fuck. I was supposed to click apply. My mouse is way too sensitive, I'm sorry. Anyway, back to game. Okay, resume game. It's actually a piece of shit, but Paul's all right. <laughs> Be sure to check out everyone you met. Check in with everyone you met so far. Right, so, so I gotta go back to uh, blonde lady. That I don't remember. Oh, cat. Hey there, cat, girls. Cat Ja. Cat Ja. Okay. You two actually you two look relaxed. Actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how was that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, huh? Very peaceful. You learn Clementine is a first grader. How, was How did you here? handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people. Over some, just, just. Uh, it's over okay. some. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Kinda. <laughs> this could all be providence, you know. Not what we saw. You just never realize when something is happening to you, what you're being given. Maybe this will all work out. Your optimism is refreshing. New. These past couple days, at least. Hmm. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? 
I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. <laughs> and what is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. It can, trust me. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Yeah. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. I just learned you a fire. Alright. Oh, talk to Clem. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Oh, Katya. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I was probably saying that wrong. I don't even remember how I said it. <laughs> It's like Katja. It's got two A's. The hell you expect me to call her? Alright, gotta go over here to um, chicken and <laughs> to uh, goose. So let's talk to goose. Talk to goose. How you doing, duck? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> just, just wave at him. Will it still work if I back up? Walk away from him and then I wave at him? Oh no, it makes me go to him. Damn it. It's like, hey, how you doing? 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 How you Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. <laughs> Alright, talk to Sean. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Yeah, I can think I can manage that. I think so. Does he do it by himself, or do I have to do it? No, he, he My doesn't. Dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. Wow. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... Yeah. That's the poor girl's brains out. Bastard. Poor girl's brains out. Whoa. I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. No, oh, man. I hope so, too. Maybe it's not too bad there. Maybe? That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. You're a good guy, Lee. You're a good guy. You keep doing what you do, Goose. Do you, uh, think this thing will keep him out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. Alright. If you say so. Okay, am I supposed to go in the house now and talk to Herschel? Go in. Go in, 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 can I not go in? Alright, let's go this way though. She was this way. She was this way, nothing is this way, okay, nothing at all. Gonna go into the barn. Something's gonna hop out. Scare the shit out of me. Okay, maybe not. How did I end up back here? I was all the way over there. Did I just like teleport? Um, what? I talked to everybody. Seems like an alright dude. All right, let's go talk to Kenny. Maybe can I start a conversation with Kenny? Kenny First, uh, Kenny. So, what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. 
I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Mm -mm. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Mm. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds, and... <laughs> Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. That's, that's... Stay positive, yeah. Need any help? No, I think I got it. All right. Do you need any help? <laughs> do you need... What do you mean? Me? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I have no idea. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> At least you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. See you. When Duck showed up? Wait, Duck isn't your child? <coughs> is she really your wife or is she a lie too? You have such pretty hair. It gets it, lots of tangles. Is she a lie too? Or is she really a wife, Kenny? All of a sudden you're here, Herschel, so let's talk to you. You kind of look like the Herschel from the show. Not too much. Though. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Yeah, was I do. brought up to? Yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? No wife anymore. No wife. Uh, not anymore. Uh, I think she's up in Virginia, maybe. Sorry to hear it. Oh. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yep, basically. Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? No. What is it? <laughs> I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. <laughs> oh, and I'd start checking the attitude, friend. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Go! I'll get my gun. What happened? Is it duck? <laughs> no, I hear zombie. Oh, duck, you dumb piece of shit. The zombies look so bad. My leg is stuck on me. You chose Sean. Save Sean. Okay, let's save Duck. Kenny, you got Duck. I got you. Kenny, help me! Oh, what a Kenny! dick. No. God damn it. Push it. Push it. Push it, Lee. Push it. Push it. Just push it. Just push it. You can do 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 it. Oh, they're gonna break the fence. They're coming in. You're dead, Sean. Oh shit. I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. I can fix you, don't worry. We'll stitch you up. It, it almost it almost got me, man. It, Lee tried to save me. I know, son. I... Uh... Don't put your face that close to his. He's try and eat you. He's gonna try and eat you. Move your face, Herschel.
Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry! You tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. You're gonna fuck you, Kenny. You can't blame Kenny. The hell I can't. You watch your back. We can kill us your daughter and you need his help. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Somebody might want to turn off that tractor. You're wasting gas. Just saying, you know. Zombie apocalypse and all. You might want to save your gas. Got that ride to make it if you want it. Well, you gotta leave. Might as well go to make him. <gasps> I'm tired. Oh, I don't get to choose. They automatically take him to make him. All right. This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Kenny's gonna help us out. Damn. Look! Duck, you might want to stay close. Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. He's a zombie. Fuck! Hey, look, a bunch of them. I didn't see that coming. You know, it's a zombie apocalypse and all. Not again. Oh, hey. Look at her.